moga wa action se u petetse se bo ka sa ona sa mano sa matsatsi a mararo seneng se tshwaretse pechut hotel dikologong ya boxback ho tse ding tse neng di tlhomme pele se bo keng sena ke tshisinyo ya moga ma bapile bo ka go hle ba le keno le miputso e sitana le katoloso ya matlole a moshelela moga o bolela ha maikemisetso a ona ele moga o bolela ha maikemisetso a bona ho ma Afrika borwa ile ho bona ma Afrika borwa lo kolohile di tlamong tsohle tse rena mona la peng ha jwale so I'm very happy with them. There's one that talks about bridging the gap with uh, the poor and the rich. And I even spoke about this, that in the township, you'll find that our libraries, our clinics don't even have access to Wi-Fi. So our children are struggling while you go to the suburbs. And the suburbs, the clinics, the libraries have Wi-Fi. So those are things we're talking about. Illegal immigration, now they're talking about professional public service. So these are very interesting policies that will help us, that will shape the future of our people and change what is happening currently now in government. We've got the youth that's representing the province and then we've got the youth that's representing the, the region. So the first day we're talking about financing or funding student fees. So some students were debating that maybe we should give free education. Then they debated, they debated that. So it was very interesting. These are things we talk about. And definitely the youth is the future of the country. We cannot leave them behind. Action SA has been very vocal about that. If you see Action SA politicians even doing interviews, you'll note that it's young people, young people like myself, the spokesperson also Stembelo Yang, Debucho Yang, a lot of young people. So Action SA does not shy from the youth, they advocate for the youth and the youth are standing in the front line and representing the interests of other young people in the country.